In this video, we will be studying about the working of bridge rectifier. As we are aware, rectifiers convert AC to pulsating DC. Half wave rectifier gives output only for positive half cycle of the input, whereas full wave and bridge rectifier give output for both positive as well as negative half cycle of the input. This is the circuit of the bridge rectifier. The transformer is used to step down the voltage from 230 volt to the required rating. The bridge circuit consists of four diodes in Wheatstone's arrangement and the output is taken across a resistor. The diode has a property of unidirectional flow of current which allows only current to flow in one direction when forward biased. During the positive half cycle of the input, the voltage that appears across the windings are positive at the top and negative at the bottom. The same polarity is induced at the right side. Thus the diode shown in red at the top is forward biased and it will start to conduct. The current path is shown by the green line. The other two diodes shown in white will be reverse biased and do not conduct. Thus the output waveform is obtained which is in exact shape with that of the input. During the negative half cycle the polarity that is induced is shown here negative at the top and positive at the bottom. The same polarity is induced on the right hand side. The current begins to flow from the positive and the diode at the bottom shown by red is forward biased and will conduct. The current flows through the resistor and finally through the diode which is forward biased shown by red and the circuit is completed. Since in both positive and negative half cycle the current through the resistor flows from right to left the direction of the current does not reverse. Hence the output is obtained like this that is the direction of the current does not change for both positive as well as negative half cycle. The summary of the working of bridge rectifier is shown here. 